Hey there, how are you? My name is Dee Swazi. I have a word that um, struck me today and I thought that let me share it with you. Um, it's a word that spoke loudly in my ears and it's a word that spoke volumes um, in the silence. The word that I heard from the Lord was, don't compete, complete. And I was like, God, what do you mean? What are you saying? And he said, don't compete, but complete. And then he led me to Jeremiah 1 verse 5, which says, Before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I sanctified you. I ordained you a prophet to the nations. So what does this mean? You are not here by mistake. This is what God said to me. He said, you are on an assignment. And you need to find out the mind of God concerning your assignment. Um, you see, God has, has given each and every one of us a gift is given us each and every one of us an ability and is given each and every one a task so if we find out what his mind is concerning our assignment our lives would be that much easier instead of looking at your neighbor's assignment you would focus on your assignment and then in that way you are not trying to do what someone else is doing or you're not trying to beat what the next person is doing but you're trying to complete your assignment here on earth every day is an opportunity for you to do something in connection in line and with regards to God's ordained assignment for your life so don't compete but complete and then he also led me to Psalm 139 verse 14 which simply says that you are fearfully and wonderfully made and therefore you need to have the confidence in your God ordained assignment and in your God intended purpose and you need to run with the vision if you know the mind of Christ concerning what it is that you need to do with your life and you know the heart of God concerning your purpose about your life trust me you will be unstoppable so when you do things when you um, begin to to try and start a business start a career and do whatever it is that you want to set your mind to try and not necessarily want to beat someone else but be who God intended you to be be who God ordained you to be that way you will be unstoppable each and every one of us has got a God ordained purpose each and every one of us has got a, a God intended purpose for us being here on earth you need to find the mind of Christ concerning your mission you need to find the mind of God concerning your mission and you need to make sure that you complete it time is running out Jesus is coming back make an impact make an impact and make a change and make sure that you you affect and impact as many people as possible while fulfilling your purpose in God love you so much take care